Hey everybody, welcome to Backstage Access. Your host Satoshi here. And just finished watching the movie The Pope's Exorcist. And as per tradition, yeah, I'm the last one to leave this theater. So let me just walk on, on out of here real fast. All right, uh, so The Pope's, a little bit of backstory for The Pope's Exorcist. It is based on the memoirs by uh, Father Gabriel R. Moths, I think I'm pronouncing it correctly. So it is on a true and actual factual uh, right there on that note. So this one right here is a horror movie slash suspense. And as anybody who has watched my videos before knows when it comes to horror movies, I enjoy them. And also suspense movies, blood, gore, the shock, the shock value is there all there. So did this one actually live up to my expectations of horror movies? Time to find out. So let's just say that this one, I was hyped to see it, see it based on the trailer. Something okay, something paranormal. It's gonna be a good horror film. I'm gonna be scared, shocked, and nothing at all. It just the only good thing about this one was the visuals, which gave that very gothic feeling ancient mysterious that was the only good thing about this movie story-wise <laughs> so much was missing pacing just slow in some parts of it and let's face it some scenes i was actually laughing because it was so predictable what was gonna happen in there so this one right here is gonna get a seven out of ten and that's being generous based on the actual visual so it doesn't get a higher mark thanks to the seven other than that wait for it on streaming when it comes out available wherever or if you're really bored check it in the theater however you know you're not missing that much so that's all i gotta say about the uh pope's exorcist and it's your call so you've been warned if, if you want to see something scary or a good horror movie, I would say go for a Terrifier 2. Right there, that one's Top Notch Horror. Or also, X and Pearl. Those are also good, you know, suspense horror movies right there. Go for those instead if you want to watch something at home or pretty much on streaming service right there. So for now, folks, this is Satoshi. Be safe and bye.